people would run up, you know, and try to get an autograph. We didn't do that. You know, the celebrities would run up to us and get I an know. autograph. So it was, was hard. it was the flip script. So the gang kind of took over. You know, uh, when Pip, when, when 50 Cent first seen me, he like, hey, you know, uh, Pip <laughs> saying, hey, up? Hey, you know, no, and, and you, uh, Nelly. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we going to talk. Uh, like, can't like y'all. Like, like the, the celebrity can get to some people. And they be, become this, it amplifies their character in a way to where it becomes distasteful sometimes. This I, I see this in a lot of people. I've met a lot of people like this. That's why I know I can speak on this. Right. Everybody not approachable. Right. Let true. me switch it around from the game perspective, right? <clears throat> Guys like me and Valentino, we used to the Rolls Royces. We used to buying the new cars. We used to the jury. So before we came a, a star, or so to speak, before we came known in the public, we was already known in the streets. So that never affected us. You know, like we would see celebrities and, you know, uh, uh, people would run up, you know, and try to get an autograph. We didn't do that. You know, the celebrities would run up to us and get I an know. autograph. So it was, was a, hard. it was the flip script. So the gang kind of took over. You know, uh, when Pip, when, when 50 Cent first seen me, he like, hey, you know, uh, Pip <laughs> yeah, said, hey, up? you know, no. And, and you, uh, Nelly, you know what I'm saying? We, I'm sitting in, in uh, I guess, I, I can't forget, I can't, man, everybody know that bar, that bar over there on 10th and uh, PC. I can't remember that. I think it was the shock, shock bar, whatever. But I'm in there, so Nelly's sitting right here, and I'm right here, and Nelly, you know what I'm saying, me, at this time sold 10 million records. He looked over, and my guy, uh, damn, I don't remember his name. He uh, from Minnesota, my guy from Minnesota, he gonna be mad because I don't remember his name, but he 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 bought a couple of bottles of champagne, and uh, so he said, "Man, get Nelly in a bottle." So I reached over there, I gave him a bottle, and Nelly looked at me, and said, "Pimp and Ken," and it was like everybody, you know, was looking at us, you know, like we was the shit, you know what I'm saying? But we didn't know we was the shit. We was just out there doing our thing, you know. And I guess it may be because of pimps up hold down. These I ain't gonna lie on these niggas, you know. You know, these niggas, they listening. So, I'm, you know, these, these niggas was all happy to yeah. see us. Yeah. Same thing with Bishop Don Juan. Same yeah. thing with Valentino. Every time I go with him, Gotti, all them uh, big jerk, they love this brother. They love you it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And he got that same effect. We got an effect on, on the people that's rapping about because in some way they believe they're rapping about our lives. So, you know, we never got overexcited or overzealous about being a celebrity. You know what I'm saying? Man, he he always would tell me, Ken, you can do this. Ken, you can do this. Ken, Ken, Ken. And I'd be like, man, I ain't got time for that shit. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm just going to be normal. I just want to go to Big T, sell me some DVDs, go to uh, That's me. Ecstasy, sell That's some real. DVDs. Keep uh, it in color. Uh, uh, go to Jackson, pull up on my man Gino. You know what I'm saying? Man, mess with my guys from the Goon Squad, you know, and sell them some DVDs. Go to Atlanta, go on the east side, go to Milwaukee, go to... Uh, where well, we go to uh, uh, Playmakers and uh, 14th Street, and I'm cool. Where it is? I'm cool. I don't want to be like this. You know what I'm saying? I mean, even though I have the biggest organization in hip hop, I got 4,000 members, 25 chapters. All my members will tell you I'm the same. They can't believe it. You know, you know who uh, else can't um, have that type of effect on people? Who? Uh, Double D. Yeah, my Double cousin. D. Yeah, Double D was Double cold. D was like that? Man, oh, they yeah. They loved him. They loved him. They loved him. They they loved see him. him. When they see him. Yeah, they loved him. They they yeah. would they would start what they doing try to acknowledge it man Good like dude. how did you end up first meeting Nelly though Nelly uh, I don't know him like that I met him a lot through, of, I met through, through Ken, Ken. So I met him through a social Ken I would tell you never locked in like you never locked that. in yeah. but you just yeah. like you just like yeah. see they you see and, and and that's what it's all about man building relationship right. in some kind of way this dude right here like I said he had this effect on people. They're like when we first came, when the people's out there in the parking lot, they gonna see him. They gonna be excited, man. Right. Because they done all of the work that you put in too, though, right? But but you know, you know where I really got the 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 old man in prison, right? Name Mister Black. He I can remember his name. Wow, I remember (laughs) nigga in prison, but I can't remember. (laughs) Ain't that the way it go? Uh, I can't remember the dudes that's out in the streets, but that's weird. I'm institutionalized, but anyway, text Derek. Any anyway, uh, uh, Mister Black told me. He said, man, you got that it factor. Because when I used to be in prison, I was a little skinny nigga, black. I mean, I was a little skinny nigga, E, but everybody respected me and loved me in the joint. I messed with the D.C. dude. Everybody. The Milwaukee, the Chicago crew, the, you know, everybody, you know. So I go in the yard, man, everybody showed me love. So that's, I think, where I first got that spirit. I think it's a spirit, you know what I'm saying? I mean, 
And that's like I said, you know, too short, all them people. I go to their house, man, it's a spirit. Mm -hmm. And people trust mm -hmm. me instant, instant. You know, like I've been to his crib, you know what I'm saying? People trust <laughs> me. People trust me immediately. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.